So let's talk about unit prices with unit conversions up to 20. This is a fun, this is just a fun practical lesson because, uh, you know, these are, these are measurements that show up in your life. So you'll go to Costco or whatever grocery store you go to and you can think about this stuff. Is this a better deal, right, than something else? Sometimes you have to convert and do some quick calculations in your head to figure it out. So it costs $7.80 for a five quart jug of toothpaste. What is the price per cup, okay? Well, how many cups are in a quart? There are four cups. in one quart. So what will that give us, right? So we have $7.80 divided by five quarts but then we can multiply by, we want to put quarts on top so they cancel, right? So one quart divided by four cups. So what we want to do is do 7.80 divided by 20. And that will be the price, because 5 times 4 is 20. Another way you can think about it is you do 7.8 divided by 5, and that's the price per quart. But then you have to divide that by 4, because every quart has 4 cups. So you're basically taking 7.8 divided by 5, and then dividing it by 4. So... That's 7.8 divided by 20. Okay, so this will go in three times. Three times 20 is 60. So we'll get 1.80. And then that will go in nine times. So the price per cup is 39 cents. A three quart jug of juice costs 240. What is the price per cup? Okay, let's do this a slightly different way. Maybe that was confusing. So let's try it a, a different way. So 2.40 Uh, divided by three. So what's one quart? Well, it's eighty cents. So one quart is eighty cents. If one quart is eighty cents, well, how many cups are there in a quart? There are four cups in a quart, so we have to divide 80 cents by four, and we'll get 20 cents. Okay, the price of a three-quart container of a molasses costs $1.56. What is the price per cup? Okay, so 1.56 divided by three, just to skip some of the, the math. Uh, you know, 50 cents times 3 is $1.50, so we need an extra 2 cents. So we'll just go 52 cents per quart. But then how many cups are in a quart? 4, so we have to divide 52 by 4. Now you can kind of just feel around what, what answer there is right, right? That's going to be 13 cents. 10 cents is too small, 23 cents is too big, so it's going to be 13 cents. Okay, $1.44 for three quarts. So 144 divided by three is 48 cents. 
What is the price per cup? So now you do 48 cents divided by four and you get 12 cents. Three quarts for five dollars and four cents. So each uh, each quart will be a dollar sixty seven. I just did five oh four divided by three or dollar sixty eight rather, sorry. But I'll work it out. So we have one, three, two. This is going to give us a seven or six rather times eighteen. It's going to give us a twenty-four. Will give us an eight. So we have a dollar sixty-eight. Okay, so it's a dollar sixty-eight for one quart. And then a cup is 168 divided by 4. So 168 divided by 4 will be 4. Two. Right, so it'll be 42 cents. Awesome. 42 cents. Okay, so now we're doing pounds. So there are 16 ounces in a pound. So a three pound container of ground beef costs 576. So let's actually figure out what one pound is. So one pound let's see if we can yeah okay so one pound is one third of 576 right so 576 is close to six dollars right so our answer will be close to two dollars but then we're 24 cents off right so we have to divide 24 by 3 and get eight cents so our answer should be 192 so 192 per pound right so 192 per pound is the yeah, it's 192 per pound. So what is it per ounce? It's 192 divided by 16, which will give us 1, 16, 32. So it'll give us 12 cents per ounce. Okay, so Kayla buys a three pound bag of candy. To collect money from people, she needs to divide it up into $8.16 per ounce. What is the price per ounce of candy? Okay, so we're gonna just ignore this. I think it's basically saying a three pound bag costs $8.16. What is the price up per ounce of candy? Okay, so we're just going to say $8.60, and also just based on the fact that that would be really expensive candy if it were $8.60 per ounce. So $8.16 divided by three is gonna give us two something, seven, two, so, One pound is two dollars and seventy two cents. And so an ounce would be two seventy two divided by sixteen, which would give us one times sixteen. So we end up with one point one, which would be 1.12, which will be, what is that? 
7. Right, so 7, 1.12. So it's 17 cents per ounce. Evan buys a two-pound bag of candy for a party to collect money from people he needs to divide it up. So 704 divided by 2. I'm just going to write the answer. That's going to be $3.52. Then he has to divide that by 16 to get price per ounce. And we can kind of eyeball this, right? If it were 20 cents, that would be 320. So we need another 32 cents. We need to add two cents. So it's going to be 22 cents. The answer here is going to be 22 cents. 20, 20 cents is too small. It's a little bit more than 20 cents. That makes sense. A, a four pound bag of barley costs 960. What is the price per ounce? Okay, so if it were 10, if it were $10, it would be 250 per pound. But that would be 40 cents off, so we divide 40 by 4 and we get 10, so it's, it should be 240 per pound. If it's 240 per pound, we then do 240 divided by 16. And you can tell that's going to be around 15 cents, right? Because 16 times 10 cents is $1.60, and then it's like another half of that, right? So it's 15 cents will be the answer there. And a three pound bar bar bag of barley costs 9.12. So 9.12 divided by three, that's, that's sort of easy. It's just $3.04. And what is the price per ounce? Okay, so 3.04 divided by 16. So we have one here. We have 1.6, 1.44, so we have 9, that will be 1.44, so we end up with 19 cents. Okay, and the fun of this is if you go to Costco and someone says, oh, this thing is $5 per pound, but it's, I don't know, 27 cents per ounce, or maybe 58 cents per ounce, right? How, how do you know what's, what's more expensive or or less expensive. Well, you have to do some kind of conversion. So next time you go go shopping with your parents or something like that, try to try to play this game. And I will see you next time.